<laughs> Hello Traveler! My name is Mini Mercy and I welcome you back to this wonderful adventure that is Dragon Quest Builders 2. So I did a little bit of uh, chores of camera. What's up with this place? Well, I went to the old windmill ruins and stole all of these stone blocks <laughs> so I could use them for building. I also built a room for Hammer and for Malrod. It's a little bit tiny, but that's what I want. That way we still have some more space to build more other things. And I also expanded a little bit on the farmer's bedroom. Now we have three of them. Small farmer's bedroom. Mm -hmm. And I made like a little corridor over here. Ah, another thing, very important, that I did off camera was that I dig a hole. I dug a hole more like at the front of the town because I remembered, well more like I was getting attacked while I was building these rooms, I was getting attacked by hordes of monsters, little draconids, uh, little bad guys, not bath, but like bat, of like bats, bad guys, and I realized a little bit of important information from many many years ago that I was playing dra this game, Dragon Quest Builders 2, that if you build a little hole in the ground, the monsters will not be able to climb that two <laughs> block high wall and come and munch on your vegetables. I realized that not only they destroy the buildings, but they also munch on your crops. So I was like, oh yeah, yeah, I remember. I remember the safety measures. One of them was, of course, this big hole by the entrance, or more like the front side of the town. That's the front. <laughs> but like, yeah, I am hoping that I can show you how it works and get attacked by monsters. But as for now, let's just end the day. And also continue with the story. I am hoping that we can build some more. And maybe, possibly, meet some new people in this episode. Err, uh, Hammer excited to sleep next to her companion. But not her boyfriend. It's kinda like a shame, but oh well. I also took out some of the dirt. I am thinking that I may remove that little hill eventually, but for now it can stay. It's not like I have the need to remove it right now, so let's keep it for as long as we, as long as we can, alright? So we have to speak with Brittany and see what she has to say about this whole deal. <laughs> She's just outside of town. Let her come this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There she comes. All right. <laughs> Hi. Right on, Hammer. It's pretty dope having a Wiggly in the squad. Having a Wiggly in the squad. <laughs> and we can totally get all the good dirt we need. Funny how that slimy simpleton was so eager to help us out, eh, Hammer? Seems like there's something about you that monsters really go for. Our prayers are answered. Our soul shortage is solved, and it's all thanks to Brittany. <laughs> yeah. Nah, I was just passing on some rumor I heard. It was Hammer who did all the legwork. And props to Greeley, too, for dropping everything and coming here to bail us out. Nobody knows why, but on Forofield, the Wigglies. The Bodkins and the rats have always been kind to us humans. What's a Bodkin? I guess we'll find out. Hey, maybe if you ask around in your travels, you might find out. Hmm. Complete. Okay, and she has a mission for us right away. Let's speak to her. Yo, Hammer! Now that Grigley's on board, this farm's about to seriously go off. The only thing is... The monsters are getting thirsty for our fresh fruit and veg, and as the only soldier in the furrow field and guard right now, that's kind of a problem. Obviously, we can't just stop growing food, like duh. I figured that we need is what we need is better weapons, and that's where you come in. Any ideas? If not, then mm, practice makes perfect, I guess. Maybe if you and Malrod go out and rough up a bunch of monsters, it'll give you an inspiration you need. A stone sword will be pretty lit. Make me one of those and give it to me, of course. A sword isn't much use without a swell sword here to swing it. <laughs> Which we have. <laughs> Alright, right away. 
high really by the way <laughs> Err! Hammer is getting saliva on her <laughs> On her face <laughs> Ho 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 nice Thanks so much Hammer This sword is well sick Anytime you invent a new weapon You should wax some up And give them to everyone who can swing them then everyone who's like, oh no, the monsters are too tough, will be like, oh yeah, tough luck monsters, ha <laughs> ha Oh my god, yeah, I, I agree, I agree. Back in the day, I would have been hyped for all the things I could smash with this sword, but I don't really believe in the children and their master of destruction anymore. The master of destruction? Who's that supposed to be? Does he have a name? Oh, Malrod, if only you knew. How am I supposed to know? Haiki, I bet the only person who knows his name is Almighty Hargon himself. <laughs> Listen to me. Almighty Hargon? I'm so done with him. Let's start the Children of Hammer instead. A brilliant band of building bots. <laughs> Speaking of Hargon, how, what do you reckon he's like um, doing? You don't think he's going to come and smite us, do you? Nah, it's fine. Probably, probably, possibly, maybe, maybe, maybe. Yeah, it's fine, it's fine. Wow, thank you, everybody. So I guess let's talk to Wrigley right away. Hi. We, we, guys, been custodians of the soul here on Forofield since forever. It's always been our job to keep the dirt in good nick. And now as the children of Argon are off my case, I can get started again. I can wait to see the old place overflowing with life, green from beach to blood. I suppose I should start by turning some of this horrid slime into some nice clean earth, shouldn't I? Oh yes, please, Wrigley. You have no idea how long I've waited for this. I'm so excited to see you sanitize the soil. Right, oh, but how am I supposed to know which bits they want cleaned up? I see! You're using scarecrows to mark out where you want your fields to be, so I should work my magic on the mud around them moments? Sounds like a plan. I'll get started right away. No time like the present, is there? <laughs> Alright, so I guess that means we have to. Oh, wait! Oh, go, Wrigley! Go, Wrigley! Go, Wrigley! Yes! Oh my god! Yay! We have some more clean soil to plant... plant... <laughs> As Hammer watches Wrigley's magnificent talent, she chews on a cabbage. <laughs> Great! Awesome, everybody! Hi! <laughs> Perry. Hammer's boyfriend... Oh, hold on, I wanted to speak to him. There we go. There you go, Hammer. The stink is lunch is all gone. Nothing but fine, fertile air, fertile air for your fields from now on. Ayy! <laughs> I can't believe it! Look at all this healthy earth! Yeah, look at that! We can plant so many things now! <laughs> Thank you, Wrigley! Uh, I'm so happy! Uh. I've never been so much it's never I've never been so much lovely soft soul in my life. Never seen oh my god <laughs> <laughs> Oh Bonanza you too I'm very Ever since the spoils force appeared I thought our island was doomed Even when we found clean soil everything we planted in it just withered and died What's wrong with you lot? Crying over a bit of dirt. We spent so long scrapping together a few small patches of arable earth and now we got more than what we know what to do with... <laughs> I'm as happy right now as I've ever been. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I have dog problems. Alright, 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 alright. I'm happy too. Happy to help that is. And I'd be more than happy to clean up the soil anywhere Hammer plunks down one of them scarecrows. Yay! Wonderful work, Hammer. It just so happens I have a few seats squirrels away for just such an auspicious occasion. And now we have a place to plant them. 
Yes, more weird seeds. More, 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 more. Er oh, you had those all along, Bonanzo. <laughs> you should have told me sooner. Yay, look at that. Hold on, before we speak to Rosie, how about we plant some of these seeds? Okay. Uh huh. How do you. Oh, there we go. Okay. Uh, am I pressing the right one? Yeah, I am. It says no. Hammer uh, uh, won't do it. Okay, Hammer. <laughs> we won't do it. I wonder why. Hmm. Anyway. I am guessing that it has something to do with speaking with Rosie. How should we row next? Okay, let me try it with these ones then. Oh, you know why? It's because they haven't tilled it. I see, I see, I understand. I understand. Okay then, let's wait a little bit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look at our little place, guys. I'm just so happy that this is happening. Restoring the glory of Furrow Farm to Furrow Farm. <laughs> it's going to be so exciting and it's going to be so full of beautiful things yeah there it goes that's what we needed uh, boy, uh, boyfriend <laughs> hammer watches her boyfriend <laughs> all right hammer <laughs> yep there we go now we can do it excellent all right, teamwork, everybody. Teamwork. Oh, sorry, Perry. <laughs> I pushed you. <laughs> One at a time. After Perry, but only after Perry. All right. Look at them. Look at our friends work. Well, I guess it's going to be a little bit mixed. I was carrying, I was planting the. Uh, wheat seeds on accident. Uh, that little block, that's fine. Oh! <gasps> yes! Mission complete! Make the fields bigger! Oh, now we have two out of three! Yippee! What's up, Rosie? We did it, Hammer! We did it! 50 blocks of soft, unsoiled soil, turned and tilled and plowed to perfection. Is it? Oh, I guess. Now we've got enough space for all five types of vegetable that they used to grow in Furrowfield Farm. Before the day tree withered and died, they used to grow all sorts of different crops here and hold a festival when they brought in the harvest. Goodness, Hammer, look! The day tree! Arr! <laughs> she turns like, what? <laughs> Oh, 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 day three time, day three time, yay, I had two bushes, joyous day. <laughs> the day tree's grown a little bigger, and it feels a little more powerful too. Doing this task is really doing the trick, isn't it, Hammer? Ha ha ha, standing before something so precious, I can barely contain the urge to destroy it utterly. Oh, er... The pastor's acting all funny again. Is he really going to blow it off this time? Now, hang on. When you first saw the tree, you said you had a change of heart. Was What was that all about? Silence! I will not stand by and listen to your idle chatter when you have so much more still to do. Stop wasting time and get back to work. <laughs> Alright, priest. Calm down. But yay! We have two more, we have, oh, more like we have another branch of the day tree grown. Excellent. Also, let's finish planting these seeds, shall we? Oh, wrong one. Uh, oh, there we go. Yes! I am so happy, you guys. Good things are happening. I cannot wait to show you what kind of plants I have for this place. Also, let me move this torch, by the way. And let's put it over here. Mm -hmm. Perfect, perfect. Uh -huh. 
One last seed, everybody. Right here. Let's also collect this. <laughs> Thank you, Rosie. <sighs> Things are going well. Well, I mean, we should just speak to her, am I right? Hold on. They're saying hello to each other. Let them separate. <laughs> they got fused for a moment. We've got so much more clean soil now, Hammer. The field even smells better, rich and earthly. Not all rotten like before. I thought between you, a builder and me, the finest farmer on Forofield, we had the perfect duo. But now with Grigley in the mix, we've got the perfect trio. Yay! Now we can make as many fields as we want. But that won't help us if we don't if we don't have the seeds to plant in them. Brittany told me about the ruins of an old farm somewhere to the northwest, on the other side of the mountains. Sounds like you sounds like just a place to find some more seeds, right? I'll mark it on your map for you. So go and see what you can find. A new destination has been added to Hammer's map. Alright. A farm northwest of here. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Tell you what, we will store the wheat for now. We will store our building materials. Leave only the bed. Press like that to organize. Mm -hmm, I like that. And we should go right off. Also, mm, let me think. Bonanza was able to hold a sword, am I right? So I am kind of wanting to give him a stone sword before we go. So him and Brittany can keep... Oh! Oh, we can also make one of these for Malros, absolutely. I totally forgot. And one of these for Bonanza. Perfect. And we go out. Uh-huh. Oh, Bonanza! Bonanza, Bonanza, Bonanza. Here you go. And give me the stick. And now this one for Malroth. Err, where's friends? <laughs> Malroth, where are you? I mean, we can just walk. Oh, there he is, but let him come to us. Malroth! Here he comes. Uh, 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 here I am. Okay. <laughs> there you go, boy. Nice! What's this? Did you make me a new weapon? <laughs> Thanks, I love it. Ha, ha, ha. I'll use this one from now on, but I'll keep off the Oaken Club you made me too. After all, it's the first thing you ever made me. I suppose it's got sentimental value. Oh, that's 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 sweet. But if you invent any weapons that would make me deal even more damage, build them straight away and hand them over. Alright, awesome! So, hold on, let's check our map. Uh, hey, let's view our destination. We have to go over here, so how about we teleport? Let's go to the dock. I also learned how to teleport by way of camera. <laughs> you just have to press the destination and press A, basically. Alright. Here at the docks, we're gonna be having an adventure. Hammer and Malroth visit the old farm. Hammer and Malroth will make everybody happy. Alright, how about we climb this mountain? I don't wanna go around it. Let's just climb it, shall we? Oh, Hammer is a good climber also. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> oh, wait, we have somebody over here. I see. Let's go talk to them. Hello, fat rat friend. Squeak! Hi there, human. Are you looking for your friend? He's just over the, 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 the other side of this hill. But he seems to have gone a little crazy. Last I checked, he was singing, swinging his hoe around like a madman. If he's not your friend, you might want to steer clear. You can always just go and have a look. But don't blame me if he clocks you on the noggin with a piece of farming gear. What? A friend? Somebody we don't know is just swinging the whole hole around. Also, I brought a bed with us this time. Whoa, what's happening here? 
Okay, how do we get down this hill, you may be <laughs> asking yourself. <laughs> Let's come up this way. Mm -hmm. Hammer is worried about that person if he really is crazy. <laughs> Hammer wants to help the person if he's in trouble. Oh yeah, oh yeah, what's happening here? Huh. And we have a mission over there, I'm guessing that's the mission marker. Hello? Ugh. What is this fiendish farmyard still doing here? Don't worry, I'll have the whole flask of things torn apart in no time. Hmm? I don't know who you are, but if you're not going to help, then I'd rather you leave me alone and let me destroy this place in peace. I give. I, I, I beg your pardon? You heard there was an old farm around here, and you were hoping you could find some seeds? <laughs> well, I expect this is the farm you're looking for. Don't worry, I'll soon have it completely obliterated. As for the seeds, I have some, but I won't give them to you. There's no nobler a goal in life than wrecking ruin, you know. I'm sure the master of destruction himself is watching me right now as I smash this place to smithereens. <laughs> you know what's funny is that he is! <laughs> it's moderate! Oh my god. All I can say is, it's a small mercy this place doesn't have one of those accursed scarecrows. Those infernal puppets have some kind of dark power over me. Just one glance at one and I can't resist stealing the soil around it. Confound my farmer's blood! Whatever you do, stranger, don't use that wooden workbench to build a scarecrow and then place it in the middle of this field. Don't even think about it. <laughs> Err, Hammer has an idea. <laughs> Alright. Before we speak to the rats, let's build a scarecrow. And do exactly as he says. Hmm. <laughs> I'm just looking around, see what I can take. Alright. Oh, what did I... Oh, my soil, I see. I'll take it out in just a second. Yay! You're not gonna guess what we did, dude. <laughs> oh no, did you really put a scarecrow in the middle of the field? Right after I specifically told you not to? <laughs> what? What is happening to me? Oh! <laughs> there he goes! <laughs> go boy, go! Till that earth! <laughs> I wonder what his name is. <sighs> it's just as I feared. One glass at a scarecrow, and I can't stop myself from tilling the earth around it. Oh, Master of Destruction, hear my prayer! I have solid my hands with the stain of creation. I beg your forgiveness! Oh, and then he pops out <laughs> gratification points. It is only by your destructive grace that the field was not enclosed by wooden fencing. Were it so fenced in, I feared I, uh, that I... I... You didn't happen to spot the pieces of wooden fencing stuck in the ground behind this field, did you? Whatever you do, do go and fetch that wooden fencing over there and fill in the gaps in the fence around this field. Do you hear me? No fences! Oh my god! Ah! You will not believe this, but Hammer has another idea. <laughs> now you're just messing up with the guy, Hammer. Arr, a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> you are scary sometimes, Hammer. <laughs> so hold on. Uh, let's take it out with Y. There we go. Also, let me take out my soil again. Like that? Mm hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, Hammer has malicious intent. <laughs> <laughs> All right. There we go. Oh, Eureka! Hammer learns our new recipe. What is it? Wooden gate. Ooh, no frills fencing that swings on hinges. Can be opened and closed. And wooden fencing. Awesome. A cylindrical wooden stake for constructing sturdy stockades. Connect when placed adjacently. Alright! <laughs> Good job, Hammer! Enormous fields! Wow! Would you look at that? Let's speak with the poor little guy over here. We are so totally messing with him. You, you put a fence around this field, didn't you? Why would you do that? 
No! It's happening again! Why? Why? <laughs> this poor guy! <laughs> there he goes! Oh my god! <laughs> I am so sorry, guy! Oh, I'm so sorry. I scraped the microphone a little bit. <sighs> I couldn't help myself. I plugged every inch of earth inside that accursed fence. Just like devil, I expect you've worked out how to build wooden fencing and wooden gates yourself, too! With gates and fencing, you can make fields or almost any shape and size. They are dangerous weapons indeed. Oh, master of destruction, hear my prayer! Once again, I have stopped my brow with the sweat of destructive labor. I beg your forgiveness! Pop! <laughs> What's that? If I want to till some more fields, why don't I go and help out on your farm? What are you trying to imply? I'll have you known I'm a devotee, a devoted disciple of the children of Hargon. <laughs> this guy's hilarious. Let's take him back to the farm and turn him into a builder. Oh. <laughs> All right, weirdo. If you got any seeds, hand them over. And no funny business. We can do this the easy way or the fun way. Oh my god. All right, all right, here you go. They're all yours. <laughs> Take him. Hammer of days, 10 wheat seeds. <laughs> Brilliant. Looks like we got enough seeds to make coming all the way out here worthwhile. Now, let's get Tommy Tills a lot here back to the farm. <laughs> Tommy Tills a lot. <laughs> the name's Clayton. I'll go with you. I'll help you on your farm. I'll do anything you want. Just please don't kill me. <laughs> poor Clayton. <laughs> we are so messing with the poor guy. <laughs> Clayton joins Hammer's body. If someone help me. Alright, we'll be back, rats. Hold on, give us a second. Oh. Oh, he's a fighter. We need to give him a sword. Oh. As soon as we can. Don't worry, guy. Uh, it's running away. Okay, hold on. I want the wood. <laughs> Alright. Oh, you know what else? Uh, I don't think we can teleport with a guest, am I right? Let's test it out, shall we? Yes, I hope that... Yeah, he comes with us! Awesome! <laughs> we have adopted a new friend! <laughs> Alright! Oh, Everybody's coming here to welcome him! Everybody's so sweet! Let's talk to him! Unbelievable! Look at all this farm! These buildings, these fields, this tree! Truly such sinners are beyond redemption! Such shameless construction, such brazen, brazen building! This whole town stinks of creation! You're heretics, the lot of you! Heretics and builders all! <laughs> oh. Reverend! This woman is a builder, a foul, irredeemable sinner! Do something! Destroy her! <laughs> oh ho oh, oh. ho! You could not have arrived at a better time, my disciple. You must work the fields here. You must till the soil and water the crops with neither rest nor respite. No, 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 not you too. Why, reverend? Why? <laughs> Very well. I will join you in your den of iniquity. <laughs> I can disobey the pastor's orders. <laughs> Clayton joins Hammer's team. Real long, Tesla. <laughs> and here's the welcoming fanfare. Welcoming fanfare. Awesome. <laughs> we did it, Rosie. Amazing. Great work, Hammer. You didn't just find some new seats, you found a new friend, too. Clayton's just like me. A descendant of one of Furrowfield's finest farming families. <laughs> that must be why we can't help but plug any field he sees. I've been thinking, Hammer. We've been doing it as the pastor said. Now we've got nice big fields and the danger is growing bigger too. Uh huh. But surely, those three tasks he gave us can't be all there is to it, can they? It just seemed too um, easy. What do you mean, Rosie? I suppose we'll just have to wait and see. In the meantime, let's build more scarecrows, till more fields and grow more crops. We could even try making fields, making fields into interesting shapes and sizes, 
by fencing them off with wooden fencing and wooden gates. Try it out and see how it goes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Before we do that, though, number one, I'm going to eat. <laughs> oh, hi, Bonanza. Number two, I'm going to go back to the rats. Give me just a second, okay, Bonanza? I'll be right back. Come on, Malrath. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Before we go, we have to make a sword for our new friend, Clayton. Build. Uh, let's, let's take this one. Like that? Uh-huh. Clayton, where are you? I see you. Here you go, new friend. For you. Made with a lot of love and patience and care. Take good care of it, alright? Alright, Malroth, now we go. <laughs> it's raining! Wow, it's our first raining burrow field. Err, hammer is soaked. <laughs> Don't worry, hammer. You'll be fine. Err, hammer hasn't gotten a cold in her whole life. Hammer resistant. Hammer vaccinated. <laughs> Good job, Hammer. <laughs> okay, let's return to the rats over here, shall we? Rain and all. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Huh, rain. Should we be worrying about putting roofs in our buildings? <laughs> that would be fun, right? Oh, I see a treasure chest also. Hello there, human. I'm as hungry as a church mouse. Seriously, I'm starving. Squeak! All I have are these wheat seeds, but I get really bloated when I eat wheat. I think I have an intolerance. Oh, you poor thing. Do you think you could help me out? If you gave me 10 cabbages, that would keep me fed for a while. You can have these wheat seeds in return. Sure, of course. Talk. Hey, human. Those look like nice, juicy cabbages. And you've got ten of them too. Well, hand them over. Come on, I'm starving. Hand this over? Yes. There you go, friend. Thank you so much. You've saved my life, human. I might be a rat, but I'm true to my word. Here are the seeds I promise you. Hammer of ten, ten uh, seven wheat seeds. <laughs> I knew you'd come through for me. After all, us rats and you humans used to be on the same side. <laughs> What? You don't know anything about it? Well, we... Actually, now that you mention it, I don't remember much about it either. <laughs> well, complete. <laughs> it's good to be asking around anyway. Thank you, friend. Take care. Alright, what's in here? Oh, cabbage seeds, of course. Look at this beautiful chimney. That's an idea we should be taking also. Oh, it's also getting late. I wonder if... no, this gives fiber. I was gonna be like, do you think this gives seeds? No. Alright, enemy friends. Oh, watch out, Mulroth! Oh, Mulroth, don't worry. I'll fight the guide for you. You can rest. Oh, we should also be trying our new special attack. Hmm. Let's see, it's getting late. Come here, Mulroth. Let's rest. This time I did bring a bed with me. <laughs> you know. It's morning. <laughs> Arr, you didn't sleep, Malroth? Nope, I kept watch. Alright. Alright, understandable. <laughs> Thank you, friends. Alright, let's talk to the other rat, shall we? Uh huh. Hi. Oh, ran too much. Hello? Talk. Squeak! Hi there, human! A high-minded, high-bro, high-class girl like you should have no problem at all with heights, right? Then I know a couple of tricks that are perfect for someone like you. Skills for swiftly scurrying to the loftiest spots, Squeak. Any adventurer worth his cheese knows how to climb. After all, you never know what you might find at the top of a mysterious hill. If you have a wall handy, you can put blocks against it to make a staircase. If not, you can build a tower by jumping straight up and putting a block under you before you land. <laughs> awesome! Master, mastery of this 
techniques is the key to quick climbing. Give it a shot right now. There's a treasure chest up above me and it's yours for the taking if you can reach it. Ooh, treasure, of course. And uh, you see this wall, right? I'm guessing that we can just follow. Mm -hmm. The pattern, oh, excuse me. Would you mind? <laughs> What's up with that guy? Pick the treasure at the top of the wall. <gasps> what is that? What is this? Hold on. Seed of life. Uh, show description with minus. There we go. A scrumptious seed that grants great vigor. Raises max HP by five. Are you kidding me? Of course. Let's eat it. Yay! Hammer's maximum HP increased by five. Awesome! We got stronger. Thank you, Rat. Squeak, squeak! Very well done, human. Who would have imagined a seed of life would be hidden away up in those old ruined rafters? Did you have much trouble getting up there? If you're still finding it tricky, just keep practicing. You'll master it eventually. Yay! You look like something of an adventurer to me, human. Hopefully these climbing skills will aid you in your travels. That seed of life should be quite helpful, too. It has the odd effect of making you just a little bit tougher if you eat it. You'll find incredible items like that in all sorts of unexpected places, so don't be afraid to go exploring. You never know what you might stumble upon. They say the rarest and most valuable items are always hidden in the hardest to reach places. So keep a keen eye out on your travels. Complete! Thank you, rat friend. You're very sweet. Er, and I guess we just go back home. Am I right? Is there anything else? Let's check the place from this little corner. Ah, oh, the view. Look at this place. Wow. Oh, hello. Can I help you? You're a little bit hard to reach. All right. Uh oh, an army. Uh oh, ow. Err. Hammer got smacked, but Hammer is fine. Uh oh. Let's watch out, though. We do not want to be overwhelmed. Give it some space to that skeleton also. Uh oh. Uh oh. Let's select the cabbages. Eat hammer, eat. Okay. My goodness! It's war out here! Uh oh. Alright. Ow! Ow! <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> Look at Malra! <laughs> Medicinal herb! A carefully prepared pouch of pain relieving leaves. Oh, restores 30 HP. That's gonna be so helpful. Thank you, Hammer. Who gave that one? I think it was this. Yeah, it was those guys. I see. Oh, we were in trouble for a second. Whew. I do not want to. I don't think. We no, we can't eat them. Okay. Whew. That was dangerous. Oh, uh, let's just teleport back home, shall we? Like this. Ah, uh, yes. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. And before this episode ends, how about we talk to Bonanzo and see what he has to say about all of this? Yeah, maybe I'll add a roof to the buildings, but it will be super tall. That way the camera won't get wonky or do something. Thank you, everybody. You guys are doing such a good job. Err! Hi, Perry. <laughs> Hammer wants to ask boyfriend out on a date, but Hammer too busy to date. Such is the way of the adult. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's talk to Bonanza. Ah, uh, Hammer. I see improvements to my village are proceeding apace. And your skills are, as a builder are improving likewise. Wonderful work, my girl. As a builder in chief of our humble home, 
It falls to you, young lady, to inspire us by ringing that great bell once more. Oh! Have you the power already, or will you need to gather more gratitude from your fellow townsfolk first? You should fulfill our requests, build beautiful new buildings for us to use, and fields for us to tend. Our appreciative energies shall surely flow like water and litter the ground below. Alright? Speaking of which, it must be sometimes be a bother gathering up all that gratitude, must it not? Well, I hear that some I hear something interesting might happen if you give the builder's bell a short, sharp strike with your weapon. Give it a try and see for yourself. Oh, I'll see. I see, I see. Let's, uh, well, there's the mission. Let's hit it like this. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, and it also calls up everybody to the town square. I see, that's cute. Also, we have two missions right here. Let's see, let's talk to... Uh, hold on, Clayton. There we go. <laughs> you drag me out here against my will. You force me to toil in your fields. I am a devout follower of the children of Hargon. Can't you understand that this is a living hell for me? Oh, wise and powerful master of destruction, please have mercy onto your wayward children. What? What do you mean I looked like I was having fun when I was stealing that field? Speak for yourself, you... you builder! In fact, if you love building so much, builder, why don't you go ahead and build us a barn? You say that this is a farm, yet you don't even have one of the bare necessities. What you want is a room with a chest, a haystack, a set of farming tools, a coil of rope, some firewood, and a pot. <laughs> Alright, Clayton. Okay, chest, haystack, farming tools, rope, firewood, and pot. That is one, two, three, four items more than a farmer's bedroom. I see. But no bedrooms, I guess. And put it all into a nice small room. Imagine a builder like yourself can help but build huge halls that tower over everything. We'll try to be a little more humble about it, will you? About the size of it. There are five different sizes of room. You can check by how big a room is by pressing minus when you're inside it. Oh, I see. Alright, we have to make a barn. Er, hello, boyfriend. <laughs> hello, girlfriend. Everything's coming along lovely, Hammer. We got our fields, we got our cabbages, and we got our wheat. And there's something else we got, too. Hunger pains! You know how yummy those cabbages are, but the rest of us ain't had a chance to eat them yet. What we really need on this farm is a chest full of food. Then we'll be able to help ourselves to something whenever we're hungry. Please, Hammer, I promise I'll never bother you for anything ever again. Just, file, just fill a chest up with 30 cabbages and let us eat. <laughs> of course. <laughs> of course, boyfriend. Okay, so... Uh, I mean, we can use this chest right away. And I mean, let's put away... I will keep 30. Then I'm going to be... Doing it like... Uh, well, yeah, that's fine. There we go. Nice. Er, where's boyfriend? <laughs> Here he comes. Hammer, my love. <laughs> Wonderful. Get on. You didn't need to say another word, Hammer. I saw you squirreling away those cabbages for me. You know, chests aren't just useful for storing stuff. You can use them to share stuff with us too. I recommend you fill them up with lots of lovely food. Ever since the children of Argon banned us from making new things, we've been forced to rely on handouts to survive. But to act with that, now we can grow our own food and stuff, our gobs till we fit to pop. Oh, by the way, Hammer, those seeds you planted won't last forever. Once you've harvested enough times, they won't grow no more. So don't feel like you need to harvest everything just because you can. We can only eat so much, you know. Ah, I see. And complete. Understood, Perry. Coming a cropper. You'll get several harvests out of each seed you sow. 
but at some point the seeds will disappear. If you want to run an efficient farm, try to take only what you need. Oh, I see. Oh, and then we have... Sure, why not? <laughs> we can build uh, the barn of camera, I suppose. Hello, Hammer! We've got ourselves a proper little farm now, ain't we? It's blaming brilliant having a builder like you around. But more than anything, it's nice to have so much food. I could definitely get used to not being hungry all the time. Of course! There's something a bit demeaning about scar scarfing down all raw cabbages straight out of a chest. <laughs> we need a way of eating that's a bit more uh, civilized. What do you reckon, Hammer? Think you could invent something like that? If you do, then do me a favor and put it outside, will you? I've always wanted to enjoy a meal while looking out over our fields. Oh, of course, it ain't civilized to sit in moss, neither. I'll need a table to sit at and a simple stool to sit on. Then just stick whatever new culinary contraption you come up with on the top and the job's good and on. Err! Eureka! Hammer learns a new recipe! <laughs> Simple supper set! Furniture. An unassuming assortment of plates and saucers, handcrafted in a homely fashion, can be used to store food and drinks. Yay! Ain't nothing better than eating outdoors. Alright! So that's the missions for now. Should we also talk to Grigley? Let's see. We need to make ourselves a, fa a barn. A kneading station, I suppose. Uh, we also need to ring the bell. Mm. And what about you, Grigley? Is there something you want? Oh, Har! And it nice to have so much lovely clean soil about. I'm mega of a egg of a happy to help. <laughs> I never thought this day would come, to be honest. Oh, if only my old man, Pa, could have lived to see this. When I was just a whimper snapper, they gave me these treasures. They've been handed down through the generations, so they have. Now, Hammer, I want you to have them. Oh, Hammer obtains two balls of warm food? What? <laughs> Alright. Then balls of warm food are real, plop down on the ground and I'll turn the area around around them into lovely green grass. Oh my god, Grigley! Game changers! Now we can stop having those purple patches of soil. <laughs> That's amazing, you know. Kinda wanna put them here in the town square. Okay, we'll see. The second you put them down, I'll cover everything around them with grass. So don't go dropping them too close to your fields, you hear? Oh yeah. I'll suppose you put both of them balls of warm food somewhere close by, and we'll have the whole place looking green and grassy in no time. Sent to pasture. Place some warm food on the ground and really we turn the surrounding area into lush meadow. Be sure to place it within the boundaries of your base, or it won't work. Yep. Alright, we have much work to do. Much work in our hands. And I am very excited about it, actually. But, before we do any of that, I'm gonna end the episode right here on a cliffhanger. <laughs> I am going to have myself a snack in real life and for Hammer too, I guess. There we go. <laughs> but yeah you guys oh. once we are done um, with our little break <laughs> we will continue in next episode and you may find that I had already built all the things that need to be built and of course if you are the kind of those persons that say hey I actually would prefer if you could show it on camera instead of doing it off camera you know all the building then you can tell me and maybe I will consider making building only episodes that don't progress the story and it's all about beautifying the town and also doing the quest, the building quest that the villagers have for us. Let me know what you think about that idea. If not, for now, I'm going to continue doing the building of camera. What do you think about that? <laughs> but well, 
that's what's gonna happen everybody we're gonna be building and having a little snack and taking a break and then we'll continue in, in the next episode alright let's see where's a nice place to do an outro I guess where everybody is really <laughs> everybody has requests alright ah <sighs> it's done we met a new friend everybody Thank you so much for joining me in Dragon Quest Builders 2, Traveler. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed today's episode, and I will see you around for the next time. Goodbye!